Hey, what is going on YouTube? It's me, Dev Connor. Welcome back to another Minecraft episode. Let's play 1.17. Welcome back. Uh, I do have a confession to make real quick. Uh, I hope you guys didn't see it. Oh, you did see it. Yeah, I ended up building this little storage space last night. I did record it, but as you can see from the footage right now, yeah, I didn't have the best OBS settings. Like, I messed with the OBS settings, set it to advanced, and I started messing with the bitrate. And I didn't actually realize the bitrate wasn't set right. So, hopefully, things are looking real smooth now. Um, yeah, the, basically, a bitrate determines the quality of your video. If, you, if I go like this, it's not going to look all blurry. So, because I have it set to like 10,000. So, yeah, I had it set to 4,000 last night. I thought that would be adequate, but I guess it wasn't because, yeah, as you can see from the footage, Sometimes it blurs, sometimes it lags, so yeah, I got it fixed now. Basically what we're going to do in this episode is we're going to build our house roof. Okay, we're going to build our house roof. We have this little storage area right here. Uh, this is just all the storage I'm going to be using for the world. Um, I'm going to actually push this wall back as much as I need to as we go on in this let's play. But yeah, I don't know how I, exactly I'm going to organize this. I need to organize it a little bit better. Um, I do need to actually get everything I have and put it into this room. So I'm going to do that real fast and I'll come back with you guys. Right, and we are back. I got everything from my house organized in here for the time being. And yeah, this is how I'm going to be organizing things. Uh, I've got other things over here. I just need, I think I need to... Uh, Maybe I should create like pillars. That way it's like a lot easier to tell where what goes where. So I'm not sure. It'll probably be improved. I did staircase a little bit down here. We're gonna turn this entire thing into a staircase so we can get down there super quick. But that's another a project for another episode because we have to get this roof situation under control. Now I've got an idea in my head what I want it to be like. I want it to I want to actually use spruce planks for the outside of the roof, and I also want to use oak plank oak planks for like the inside of the roof you'll see what i mean once we start getting it built so yeah just gonna craft every single one of these spruce logs into spruce planks i mean oak logs into oak planks i don't know what's wrong with me well look at that um little cave over there i didn't even even notice that that's a crazy generation Maybe we'll go over there and check it out. That actually gives me inspiration for like a mountain base. I'm not entirely sure though. <laughs> we'll have to see. Okay, so there's a llama here, but no merchant. What's going on? Uh, this episode also, we're going to build a whole bunch of farms as well. It's not just going to be the roof. So yeah, we definitely need to build a cow farm as well as I've got a couple of pigs. I'm not sure if we're going to actually make a pig farm because all they really drop is pork chops. But hey, you know what? Food is food, and I'm not going to complain. All right, this series, I actually feel like now that we actually have this done. Well, it's not done yet. It's like, it's at least I started it. It's going to progress as the series go on. Uh, it feels like I'm actually playing in a, in a good world now. I don't know. Having builds and stuff in your world actually feels good. So I definitely need to get this roof done. I think I'll feel a lot better after this roof is done as well. All right, so I'm just going to have the roof kind of right here. Start like that. It's going to, of course, go up as a normal roof would. But I'm going to actually make this really detailed and good, hopefully. Go, place, place a block like that. Place another one like this. These are just temporary for now, so I can just place stairs and get this thing looking good. We probably need half slabs, don't we? I probably should have not crafted all of those into stairs because I do need some half slapped as well. So I'm gonna go. I'm gonna have to actually have to. <laughs> that was. I don't know what that was. Oh my god. Anyways, yeah, I'm gonna have to actually do some extra work and mine a little bit more trees. All right. So what I'm thinking in my head is just a roof like this, a normal roof, but also I want to add some extra detail to it. So I'm kind of ha gonna have this part jut out. You'll see as I build it, I want to have it jut out. I'm going I'm to put glass blocks here just to make it look that much better and that much more detailed. Uh, so yeah, I really want to get into building more. So I am definitely looking at some tutorials. I watched Grian's tutorial on how to make... <laughs> I watched Grian's tutorial on how to make better roofs. Now he did say to actually get rid of this block right here and have the roof connected to the building. But I actually, I don't I don't want to do that because it actually will make my house like one block smaller, I believe. The ceiling one block smaller, so. Or actually, you know what? I'm actually going to see what how I feel about it. 
Can we make this whole thing like that? So we have a decision here to make. Do we get rid of this glass and just accept the fact that the roof is going to block it or do we actually do a, what I was going to go with? You know what? I'm going to go I'm gonna go see something real quick. I'm going to go get a bunch of cobblestone and I'm going to go get my glass planes, panes that I have in my storage system. So yeah, let's go ahead and see what this actually looks like. I'm curious to see what it looks like. Alright, let's see what I have planned inside of my head. See if this actually looks right. So like that. I don't know. That kind of does not look right. I'm not exactly sure. <laughs> no. No, it does not look right. I don't like it at all. We're going with our original idea. Um, yeah, maybe next time we'll build a house that actually is built for that type of thing. I mean, it already kind of looks integrated into the build anyways, because I did build these pillars out a bit, so it does kind of look right anyways. I, at least I think it does. But what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to have this wrap around here. I'm probably going to have to get rid of these corner blocks right here just so I can build an overhang and it would look right. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get rid of these corner blocks. That just gives us extra building material, I guess. And now I could have this wrap over here, which is something I think I'm gonna have to do, or or I could, what I could do is do it like this, you know, and have it go up, and this would be a window. This would be a start of a new thing. So, like this, but that's gonna connect. I know you guys just saw that. I know you guys just saw that. We don't accept that around here. Absolutely not. That did one heart of damage on my horse. We need to get some horse armor, dude. And we also need to build a stable so that doesn't happen again. Jeez. I'm telling you, man. Everybody's so excited about the, the mountain goats. Not me, man. Not me. Look at these goats, man. Look at their eyes. You know they say. You know what they say about goats, guys, right? I don't know. <laughs> goats are connected to Satanism. Just look at this man's eyes, like, all this guy wants is the destruction of my world. Alright, just get rid of this corner block right here, place the block, place one right here, and rebuild what we just built literally two seconds ago. Right, okay, okay, it's, it's starting to look good, it's starting to look good. Actually, uh, shoot. <laughs> Actually, these should be, you know what, I'll make them too thick, why not? Maybe that'll actually look good. We'll have to see what it looks like at the end. Uh, but yeah, I was going to put oak planks on the inside. But maybe we'll make the outline of the spruce planks too thick. Like two blocks thick. Extra thick. So yeah, kind of like this. Except we're going to mine these out. Yeah, we're going to mine all of these out. We're going to put these on the outside. We're going to put glass blocks on the inside. That way it just looks right. You know, it wouldn't look right the other way around. So yeah, we do have a nether portal. I am well aware that I built a nether portal last episode and I said I was going to go into it this episode. Uh, we do have the means to do that now. Like we have a storage space, so we won't run out of storage space, which is a good thing. And yeah, maybe we actually will after we're done with building the farms, building this roof and everything, we might actually end up going into the nether. Oh yeah, that looks cool. That looks, that looks great. I think it does. Hopefully it looks good to you. <laughs> okay, these are actually going to need to become spruce actually since i'm doing it this way and i'm building it like this maybe i won't actually include that that'd be like way too many windows i think in my opinion may have ran into a couple of issues with this build let me build this out real quick yeah looks like there's a slight issue might have to push this back a little bit so maybe like one block will, will one block do it one block should do it by the way, if you're enjoying this video right now, go ahead and leave a comment down below on what you think we should do next in our survival series. Um, yeah, and also leave a like if you're liking the video. Of course, as always, thank you guys so much for the freaking support. Like, you guys are killing it on the support. I see in the last episode, man, you guys killed it. You guys have just been killing it. Like, ever since I came back to this channel in particular, I've been getting so much support. It's just crazy. So thank you guys so much. Um, Live streaming is definitely coming soon, uh, just not today. Today, I, I'm, I wasn't really feeling it, not really in the mood. Uh, can't really be super energetic when you're not in the mood. So, yeah, I definitely want to... Also, I think I can mess with my OBS settings and make the stream better, like the streaming quality better. Hopefully, I can. 
Uh, and yeah, I got a lot of plans for this channel. I really want to, I don't know, I'm, I'm really just having fun on this channel right now. I'm really enjoying it, so yeah. And, and you guys are just making it like 10 times better is what I'm trying to say. This is definitely a kind of kind of a weird roof I'm building, but hey, it's my roof. It's unique, okay? My roof is unique. Nobody's roof is like mine. I'm just kidding. I'm sure somebody out there bu built a roof exactly like mine, especially since it's Minecraft. Like, ow, I keep doing that. <laughs> I keep breaking my legs. <laughs> what is going on with me? I don't Actually, this is wrong. Uh, that was right. <laughs> I don't know. This, this is wrong. This is wrong right here. This needs to be oak alrighty now I'm gonna go get some more oak planks I broke my legs on purpose that time I think it's funny that um now you can now you can get leads pretty easily just by killing the traveler emergent and killing his goats I mean his llamas not goats because back then you would you would literally have to find a slime chunk which is not easy it's not an easy feat and then possibly make a slime farm out of it because I don't know actually I think you could find leads in chests I don't know what I'm talking about Maybe you couldn't, maybe you could, I can't remember. Doesn't the axolotl kind of sounds like a witch, doesn't it? What the heck? What in God's name? That is not allowed. What are you doing with my my freaking garden, dude? Oh, hell no. Look at that. Now I'm going to have to retill that. What the hell, man? Okay, looks like this roof is going to be a little lower. So I'm actually going to see how this connects. Hopefully it looks right. Hopefully it does. I can definitely, I can make it look right. I can make it look right. It's looking good. I just gotta get that finished out right there. Uh, from the front, it is looking amazing. I just need to get the glass blocks. We gotta do something with this wall. The wall does not look too good. Yeah, we gotta detail this wall a little bit with something. I don't know. We gotta do something, man. The wall is just looking bland, isn't it? Just cobblestone. Ugh. Get out of here, cobblestone. I don't know what we can do with it. Oh, we do have that deep slate. Maybe we'll use that deep slate. It's, it's like a bit darker than... Uh, cobblestone so maybe it'll actually create great great contrast and how did I mess that up right there I need to go fix that again as well <laughs> all right that is already looking better that is looking better I like it like it like it okay cool that is what we'll do um that doesn't look right right there all right we found out a pattern we like I think I like I like it I don't know what do you guys think about it Maybe we shouldn't be using our diamond pickaxe so much don't know what we need it really we already got obsidian so you know what i'm just gonna use it anyways i think the next step is actually going to the nether for our to progress our minecraft journey i think we need to go into the nether and uh find some freaking oh look look at that last block of deep slate of course we need to go mine for some more the next step is to find the craft a enchanting table so we need to find a couple of diamonds just two diamonds and we will we will be able to craft a crafting table i mean <laughs> a crafting table of course we need diamonds to craft that <laughs> anyways we will be able to craft a enchanting table then we'll be one step closer to fighting the ender dragon we're definitely not ready now we will we will die we'll die right now i forgot that's just the sound telling us that there's a mine shaft near of course all of the alert all of the minecraft mobs are waiting for me down here oh no no stay away from me baby Yeah, that's right. You can't get up here. Oh, he can hit me, though. It kind of makes you feel bad with the sounds he's making. Like, it's a baby zombie. I'm looking for deep slate. I don't want any trouble. No trouble. Yeah, come up here. Come up here. Come fight me. Come fight me. Ha ha. Ha ha. Stupid zombie. Zombie brain. Stupid. No, no, not you. I was joking. I was joking about that, buddy. Yeah, that's right. You stay down there. You know what? I need a, I need a bow. I need a bow. Jeez, I definitely need to put stairs here, man. This is taking forever. Yeah, you, you think you can fight me, eh? Boy, boy, cunt, boy. You guys ever watched uh, what's it called? Shit, I missed. It's where all these superheroes oh it's called the boys it is such a good freaking series on amazon prime if you have amazon prime definitely check it out dude 
And th these are our slime chunks too, like we got so lucky with the series. Uh, somehow I ended up mining straight down into my slime chunks. So if we actually flatten this area out, we can make a slime farm pretty easy. I feel like this sword's about to break. At least we're collecting some slime balls. By the way, if any of you guys know how to pull up your coordinates in game, this is Bedrock Edition. I have no idea how to freaking pull up what Y level I'm at. Because I want to check to make sure I'm at Y level 5, because apparently that's the best level for this version of Minecraft right now. We definitely, uh, we should probably uh, craft a freaking shield, dude. We need a shield. We have ores. What am I doing? We have ores. I can literally craft a sword right now. There you go, brand new fresh sword. We need to uh, find more diamonds for real. So, yeah, we're definitely probably going to check out Y level 5 as well if we can. Hello, I'm just, I just came here for the deep slate. Don't, don't blame me for wanting deep slate. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Who invited you? Who the hell invited you into my house? Mimi, did you invite that guy into my house? He was your friend. Where is he? Huh. Oh, um, don't, don't worry about that. He, he had to go run some errands real quick. I'm sure he's fine. I'm sure it's, it's, it's fine. I'm sure it's great. He's doing great. I feel so bad now. I feel like a monster. Are you guys seeing this? What is going on here? Oh my god, that was, that was so weird. I've never seen Minecraft do that. All right, look at that, look at that. Not looking too shabby. Now what I'm thinking about doing as well is like, we're not gonna make a traditional farm, we're actually gonna make a entity farm, which is something I learned uh, watching a YouTube channel today. I forgot what channel it was, unfortunately. But yeah, that's something I learned is, so if you put too many entities on one block, Minecraft will actually start despawning mobs because there's a rule where mobs, only so many mobs can be on one block. So say for instance I breed a bunch of cows on that block, it'll actually start killing off some of those cows and the great thing is that it won't kill any babies. So yeah, Minecraft is nice in that way, it won't kill any babies. So yeah, it'll start killing off the adults and I'll start getting the leather and the meat from them. I think uh, what we might end up doing is moving this back over there somewhere because we're going to make this a lot bigger than it is now as well as we're gonna go ahead and find some bees because if you don't know, bees can actually pollinate things. Uh, we need some bees, we need flowers, as well as a campfire, I believe, I don't know. As well as a few other things to make this, get this thing going. So yeah, like I was saying way earlier in this episode, I'm not exactly sure how much I'm gonna cut out of this, so it's probably way earlier when I said it earlier. Uh, I really appreciate every single one of you that came by to support me. And on my second episode, like literally, I've seen so many people from the live stream come and comment, and just some old older people, older subscribers that I remember from the past coming to support me and on my series. So I really appreciate every single one of you that commented on last episode. And also, um, I think I, I'm not exactly sure if I said this in the beginning, but I want to make my videos really good now because just because I'm getting so much support. I want to edit everything so good and I, I, I don't know, I just want to get better at commentary and I also want to make just better content for you guys in general. That's why I messed around with the settings and I actually changed the bitrate so that way you guys have the highest quality possible. Uh, this is actually going to be recorded on my external SSD so there's actually no pro issue with space. That thing is like 5 terabytes so I think I'll be pretty good in terms of storage space. That's better, that's way better. But it also kind of looks off. Oh no, looks a little bit off. Okay, that's fine, I'm, I'm willing to settle for something that looks just a little bit off. It doesn't look too bad, it doesn't look too bad. It's all right. All righty, I think we actually have to, I mean, yeah, you can kind of see where we put everything. Hold on one second. I, I did my own design wrong. I did. I did absolutely screw it up. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not using my brain. There we go. That is that is better. And it looks better on the inside too as well. So we can go ahead and sleep the night away. And I think that's the roof finished. All we need to do is get some glass blocks and place them where they need to be placed. 
So yeah, if you guys play any servers, you might actually catch me in a server. I would love to see you guys in some servers. If you guys ever see me in a server, don't be afraid to say hi, what's up. Uh, even though I have like 70, like I don't expect anybody really to say that. I only have 70 subscribers, but hey, you know what? I like playing with other people. So if you ever see me in a server, my gamer, my gamer tag is uh, devgaming 261 I believe. Yes, it's this right here, Death Gaming 2618 You ever see me on the Hive? You ever see me on Cubecraft? Uh, that's what I've been playing recently. Uh, don't be afraid to say hi. I love meeting people. So, yeah. All right, things are coming together. Just got to place these last blocks right here. Um, actually, we do need to create this overhang real quick. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Then I'll show you guys what, what the finished product looks like afterwards. All right, there you have it. That is the completed roof. Maybe I won't like it in the future and change it, but I like it for now. It is good for now. Uh, we did change up the walls as well, so we made a lot of progress on our house, actually. That would bother me if I did not fix that by the end of this episode. Not too bad, not too bad. I was actually, what I was thinking about doing is building like a window right here and like making it jut out. Okay, so something like that. As well as we need, we need more oak blanks. I think it looks okay. It looks all right. It's looking pretty good, actually. Yeah, I like that a lot. Yeah, that's looking good. It's actually looking really good. Um, maybe I should have made it out of spruce planks. What the heck? For some reason, I can't place a torch right here on this side of the block. What's going on? I'm clicking, dude. Can you hear that? I'm clicking. I'm bright clicking. I don't know why it's not working. That's weird. I can I can do it on this. All right, I'm not even going to question Minecraft physics, physics right now. Look at that sunset as the sun goes down. All right, cool. We finished our house as just as the sunset is going down. Everything is coming together. I feel like everything is coming together. I got a farm. Uh, I'm actually going to move this farm back, like I said. Also, probably going to make that entity farm. Uh, probably inside here somewhere. I'm going to have to dig out a room, design a room. And yeah, literally, I've been here for like an hour already. I've been here for an hour just building this house and building the little storage room so yeah it's literally taken me all day because i've been taking breaks in between to be honest but hope you guys appreciate the content and the work i'm putting into the content all right what we're going to do next is actually what is going on what the heck he's literally surviving underneath this pillar of blocks all right that'll take care of him anyways what we're going to do next is right in this area we're going to move our wheat farm back to I'm gonna go ahead and maybe I'll make a automatic wheat farm I completely forgot how to do it I'm sure it's not too hard uh, maybe I, I don't know alrighty let's go ahead and get this wheat farm done we're gonna make this wheat farm pretty big uh, of course we're gonna make it pretty big cuz I don't know I want I need a lot of wheat and I don't want ever I don't want hunger to be an issue anymore so we can go further and farther in Minecraft. Yeah, there is a water water source over here, but we're actually going to make it right over here somewhere. I'll actually have to see how far the water spreads, but I'm pretty sure it's nine in every direction, right? Of course, our hoe, our hoe broke right in the middle of it. Uh, looks like we are actually going to need some more water, so I'll go craft another hoe, and then we're going to get some more water uh, just to place it. Place crops side by side in each line. Apparently, that's a more efficient way of placing crops because like they'll grow faster I don't know I've, I just heard that in a video today so I'm gonna go ahead and take that guy for his word actually melon pumpkin beetroot let's, let's do beetroot in um because just because we have more beetroot seeds than anything else uh, right now let's do beetroot and wheat actually we can place we can probably do all, all of our crops yeah why not let's do all of our crops that'd be uh better right pretty sure carrots Glowberries. I think glowberries are like a vine, so we'll have to make a separate farm for that. Uh, pumpkin seeds, potato. Okay, so we'll we'll make this beetroot, potatoes, and carrot carrot farm. Okay. I really at some point need to turn my freaking game volume down because sometimes literally the game volume is so loud I can't even hear my own voice like speaking into the microphone. And there's actually, if I want to automate this farm, there's actually a bunch of things I need to craft. What am I doing? I don't know. All right, that looks good to me, looks great. I think I'm gonna build the water thing right here. Uh, there's gonna be dispensers, just gonna dispense water. And actually, um, I'm an idiot and have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, geez. 
Okay, so so what I was supposed to do is build it in like, you know what, we're just gonna go with this. We're not making automatic farm. Maybe we'll go look for a, a beehive or something and make it more efficient. But yeah, I kind of just spent too much time on that anyways. Uh, and I've got other things I want to do in this episode as well. So it's not just not just that I'm being lazy. I just I want to do other things as well. I mean, we literally have another portal over there. I'm pretty sure you guys want me to go into it. Maybe you do, maybe you don't. I don't know. Um, maybe we're not even ready for it. Maybe we still need a uh, enchanting table first. All right, guys. It looks like that is our freaking finished farm. Okay, so yeah, it was not finished yet. I'm going to make it look pretty and stuff later on in another episode. But I'm pretty tired of building. I want to go ahead and get some exploration done. So I think we're going to go ahead and head into the nether. We're going to probably look for another fortress or something similar. Uh, the nether has a lot of changes to it. So yeah, it's going to be pretty interesting to see what waits us in the nether. But I'll see you guys there. So yeah, we're, we're pretty locked off here, right? We're pretty good here. I do hear a ghast around here somewhere. So we do have to be a little bit careful. Wow, I'm I'm real excited. We were we're at the Nether now. It's like episode three. We're at the Nether. Um, I don't know why I'm building it that way. It should really be this way, right? Okay, I think that's that should be all right. We need I, we actually need to save some blocks to know where we're, mark where we're going. Oh no! Oh, that's so creepy, dude. I know I'm not the only one that just heard that. I'm actually going to head this way. Uh, hopefully we can find a actual nether fortress so we can actually get some diamonds. Of course we spawned in the place with the creepy sounds, man. There's a there's the ghast right there. Might have to kill him, take him out. I'm scared of ghast, dude, I swear. In regular survival, I'm scared of ghast. Alrighty. Cool, cool, cool beans, cool beans. I'm not scared. I'll kill this ghast. Where is... There he is. He's over there kind of far away so you know what oh more more ghast <sighs> you know what? I'm not gonna waste arrows if they're not attacking me I'm not gonna waste arrows looks like a cross keep on going what's this what is this crimson roots crimson roots wonder what that is it looks like our only way is right over by the lava I'm gonna go ahead and head by the lava maybe that'll increase our chances of Finding a nether fortress. Nether fortress, I believe it's called. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. It's been so long. There's like these long beams. I feel like we should have brought the spyglass with us. That would have made it easier. Just a little bit easier. Are we are we really running out of blocks already? I swear I brought a full stack of blocks. Sir, I come in peace. Uh, I come for the diamonds and that's it. I do, I do enjoy the blue fire. That's pretty cool. This is kind of terrifying, dude. Oh my god. The sounds do not make it any better. Not yet. Not yet. As soon as I get over here, if he's not gone, if he's not going that way. Okay, he's going that way. He's coming back. I'm going to shoot him. Screw you, dude. Haha, <laughs> get wrecked. Actually, that wasn't as terrifying as I thought it'd be. Okay, now I'm getting a little more confident with this, with combat now. <laughs> I've actually been playing a lot on Cubecraft, and there's this game mode where you literally just fight free-for-all, a whole lobby of, like, players. So I've actually been practicing my combat a little bit, and uh, I've been getting better at it. So, yeah, I don't think the gas will actually be a problem. How many arrows do we have? We have one arrow. Okay, shit, we need to be careful. It's actually pretty dangerous. It's a pretty dangerous combination if you think about it. All of these, um, I'm going to take these blocks back. All these skeletons here, man. And combined with the slow sand, it's going to be the end of me, I swear. Hopefully he gave us a little bit more arrows. All right. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're in a bit of trouble here. I did not see him. We need a... We should have crafted a shield before we came here. That's what we should have done. There we go. He dropped some arrows. <sighs> I'm concentrating so hard right now, dude. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Whatever you do. I don't have anything really valuable on me, but still. It sucked to die here. We're just going to have to bridge our way up when we get over there. How many arrows do we have now? I have no clue. I know. Okay. We had enough to take that guy out, that's at least. I actually think we can mark our way with netherite now. Netherrack? Not netherite. Netherite, what? Maybe we'll find some netherite. Apparently it's super rare. Gas? There's so many freaking gas here. 
It's not even funny. All right, thank God. We're coming across another biome. I want to get out of this biome. I don't like it. Oh, okay. Can we, uh, can't we repair our bow? Yes, we can. Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, my goodness. He teleported right in front of me, dude. Holding a mushroom. What? What on earth? That was creepy. Maybe we'll find a saddle in a chest somewhere. Don't shoot me, man. Don't. Don't shoot me. Oh, there's new blocks and stuff too. There's new blocks from the nether. What is this? What are these blocks? Uh, basically like glowstone, right? Right? I think so. What's this? Shroom lights. Ooh, we need shroom lights, dude. We're gonna light our world with shroom lights. I, I really don't see anything. Like, this is, it's kind of a trap here, man. Like there's lava every, literally everywhere I go. I mean, I guess that's the nether for you, but still, geez, man, we can't have anything that connects to anything. Maybe we'll have to go back up here and go over this way. See, this is why I need to learn how to check my coordinates. That way I'm not, like, placing blocks everywhere like this, and I can just follow my coordinates. Ooh, look! Let's trade, bro. I've never done this before. Hey, you. You want gold? Take it. What's he- Obsidian? Did he just get- Oh, blackstone. Hey, man, I don't want blackstone. I want something of value. Come here. Take, take my, you're going to take my money. Huh. This is actually really cool Mojang Im implemented this. Did you throw that and pick it back up? I didn't even get it. Oh, I did. It's fire charge. I don't need fire charge. What am I going to do with that? Here. Okay, it despawned. I had no idea what that was. All right, I'm definitely going to need to do a lot of research into what the hell is going on in this nether realm. Because, like, everything is new. Everything, I'm super scared. It's making scary noises now. Nether was never like this when I played the game. Is that dirt? Some sort of dirt block. Nether rack, isn't it? Topsoil? Is it? No, soil, so, okay. I'm not exactly sure what I'm looking for here. I'm, I'm kind of looking for another fortress at the same time. I'm also looking for something kind of new. I want to see if this goes up any. Actually going to probably go up into here. All right, looks like we're getting up to the surface here. Please be something good. Please give me a better view or something. We may be severely unprepared for this. <laughs> like we might have to actually just head back and explore the nether another episode. Oh dear God. Gas every. Oh dear God. Are you t that didn't blow up, dude. Dear God, I'm, I'm burning on fire. This is, this is fine. Everything is fine. All right, cool. Um, we're not marking our path uh, at all. Actually, I believe I can just watch back this video if I really have to. Just watch it back and... Oh, there's so... Oh, no. It's one of those things. I don't, I don't like this. Using an old PewDiePie tactic, attack from the trees. Yeah, I would totally be screwed right now if I didn't do this. Jeez. Do not take my meat. I seen you trying to take my meat. Alrighty, I have no idea wh what we're doing or where we're going. We have found nothing but uh, these trees. Do these trees drop saplings? I don't think they do. Crimson stem. Should be interesting to build with, right? You have an enchanted bow. That means you're rich. Therefore, you should give me something good, right? <laughs> Come on, dude. You got an enchanted bow. You got to give me something good. So yeah, I think right where our portal is, is where we'll end up building the base just because it's right there. Kind of want to take some of these shroom lights as well. Okay, cool. Yes. What is this? Oh, it's not a nether fortress, but it is a bastion, I believe whatever those are um this is actually gonna be incredibly dangerous hold on one second can we pro pro minecraft this what can we make can we make a hopper please tell me we can make a hopper we actually need to make these into ingot ing ingots three that is not enough for a hopper is it how much do we need for a hopper oh we need a chest with a hopper and we need a couple more yeah, because I think you can drain the things out of the hopper, you know? Now, I, what I want to know is, do these leaves are the right wart block? Okay, I thought I thought they dropped saplings. Hey, man, take this. Give me some iron ingots. 
Oh my god! What the hell? What the hell was that? I'm gonna go look. Oh, there's a guy right here. Please give me iron ing ingots, dude. Give me iron nuggets. I mean, not ingots. I can't even. Can I pronounce ignit? Ignit. How do you pronounce that? I don't know. Arrows. Well, I, I appreciate that, I guess. Last one for now. More arrows. That's good, but still, I need things you're not giving me, dude. All right, we got three more chances. If not, we might ha end up actually having to go to Overworld because I'm not fighting these piglins, dude. There's way too many. Oh, come on, one more try. Please, dude, please, please give me this iron ignit, dude. Iron nugget. Please, please, please. And, um, Ravel. Th thanks, thanks, buddy. Th thanks. No, no, no. No. Oh, oh my god. Those things are terrifying. Those things are absolutely terrifying. What if we break the chest? Will they get angry if we break break it? I don't know. Do not. <gasps> no! Run! 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 No. I'm not taking a chance. I'm going back. Heading back. See ya later, alligator. After a while, crocodile. You know what? I need to calm down. I need to calm down. I need to collect myself. You think about this logically. Is there a logical way of thinking of this? No, I don't. I have no idea what I'm doing. This is all brand new to me. So if you don't know, there is an alternative to the bucket of water in the Nether. Uh, I think that's recently added. I've just been watching content lately, and uh, apparently you can get a bucket of powdered snow. So if you go to a place that's snowing, and you put a cauldron down, and you put like right-click with a bucket. Apparently, it'll give you a bucket of powdered snow, which then you can jump from heights and still survive it, like just like a regular bucket of water. It's just snow. What is this guy? <gasps> no! No! I'm sorry. I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything, sir. Oh, shit! Shit! Fuck! Run. Run. Run with all your might, Steve. I mean, I'm not Steve. Come on, Death Toner. Oh my god. What? What? Oh. Oh my god. That's so embarrassing. That's so embarrassing, dude. Okay, so I dramatically underestimated the nether. I can pretty much... I can pretty much guarantee you my stuff is gone. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to go ahead and go mining again. I'm going to look for diamonds and stuff. But yeah, that's for another episode. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please smash that like button. Subscribe if you're brand new to this channel. Uh, we we do Minecraft videos all the time. Minecraft, uh, we live stream uh, sometimes as well. I'm actually thinking about getting on a schedule of live streaming every single Sunday at a certain time. I'm not sure exactly what time it is now, but... Every single Sunday, I think I might do a live stream. So yes, be looking forward to that. It's been Dev Colliner, and I'll see you guys next video. Peace.